So hey guys, this is your health coach Rahul and um, I'm happy to back with a small video today on the World Food Day. And you know guys, I didn't know that today is the World Food Day, but a friend of mine uh, from school, Harsha, he reminded me that today is the World Food Day and a great day to make a small video about uh, the importance of eating um, correct food. And whenever someone talks about food or uh, let's say today is world food day what is the correct food for us humans to eat uh, so it's very simple it is species specific food so we being humans uh, uh, a species uh, specialized to uh, be flexible in our choices of eating uh, the kind of food and we also being on being on top of the chain with a huge brain uh, we also um, have self-created a lot of food which kind of um, excites our taste buds uh, which kind of excites our reward center in the brain uh, the food science has progressed so much in the past 100 200 years that the scientists today the food scientists they know exactly what can activate the the reward center in the brain they design the food in such a way that it uh, keeps activating the reward center and creates addiction food addiction because that's what business is all about business is all about selling more and more products to you and making you a repeat customer of the same product but how do i make you a repeat customer of the same product i know what can create addictions i am a scientist i understand the physiology i understand the brain function and i create a perfect formula which consists of sugar uh, fat and salt uh, mix it in a perfect proportion which excites my reward center and wants me to eat that food again and again and that is exactly what has happened in the past uh, uh, century that the food science has uh, moved forward and, and do you know that the reward center is also activated by other addictive substances like cocaine or uh, or um, alcohol or uh, or caffeine uh, not caffeine but nicotine uh, so these are all uh, food products, the modern food products, the processed food products, the food that is made in the plant is basically uh, designed to make you an addict. So what is uh, species specific food for humans really? So you know, it's very simple and keeping things simple often becomes uh, difficult for everyone, for you and for me. Uh, and considering all these years that we have been conditioned to believe in wrong things like number one thing that comes to mind what we have been made to believe is wrong is that breakfast is the most important meal breakfast is not the most important meal but when you break your fast the food that you eat is most important and what is the food that actually is most important for you and me as humans so the 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 key ingredients that we need all the time constantly to nourish us is uh, protein and fat. They are the two main nutrients that we need. Protein coming from where? The source. The source should be animal protein. Okay, It doesn't mean that you have to kill an animal. You can eat cheese um, or any products that are coming out of the milk of an animal if you are a vegetarian. But if you are a non-vegetarian, then you are... Uh, your choices can expand and you can eat eggs, you can eat uh, chicken, you can eat mutton, you can, you can eat fish. There are so many things. But a suggestion to the vegetarians, at least eat eggs. You will be otherwise deficient in very uh, essential key nutrients like vitamin B12, etc. And have deficiency related health issues. The other thing that we need is fat, saturated fat. So please cook your food in saturated fat like coconut oil, ghee. Uh, avoid olive oil because olive oil in the market is adulterated. So we need to focus on eating more of fat and protein. Um, avoid vegetable oils. That's number one thing to reduce their inflammation. Nowadays, with the risk of um, the as the risk of heart disease has increased, with or without the jabs, what we need to do is identify what is increasing the inflammation. Identify the blood clotting factors and reduce that take blood thinners do your regular tests and also remember stop using vegetable oils eat more of fat and protein coming through animal sources so if you want more details you can always uh, get in touch with me on my genetic nutrition youtube channel or 9594297474 whatsapp this is your health coach rahul signing off thank you so much